Hey, all right, folks. Josh Ryan, Banabrio Farms, back with you. Uh, same day, just shot a video literally 20 feet from here, doing some more digging with the shovel. Um, come right up in here, and right away, what we find, you know, we pull this clod up. Look at that. That's a compaction layer right there. I'll tell you what. Pretty easy to find in these uh, full tillage fields. Uh, we're a no-till farm ourselves, but like I said before, we just picked this farm up, and uh, we we came in here mid-June and, and and planted these beans, and spread some lime across the top, and some fertilizer, uh, trying to make the most of it. And uh, you know, just like so many other fields out there, this field just continued to stay wet and stay wet and stay wet. Uh, kind of days after it had rained. Um, you know, you come out here, you do some uh, looking around later on with a shovel. Well, you got a big compaction layer out there, kind of hard for that water to get away. Again, you know, if we if we think about calcium and how big that molecule is down there compared to your magnesium and uh, your other cations that are going to be down in that soil, I mean, that, that calcium, I mean, that thing is a basketball compared to BBs to this other stuff. You know, what's that water going to flow through better? Uh, you know. Uh, a big old thing of basketballs or you know a, a small thing of BBs it just you know that magnesium just makes that so tight again you want to loosen that up you got if you want if your magnesium levels are high you know up above that uh, you know 15% base saturation it's time to pull some of that out of there you you know that's when the guys that push the gypsum you know that sulfur that comes off that gypsum that's what's really gonna pull that, you know, replace that magnesium in the soil and pull those magnesium numbers down all the while maintaining your calcium number, right? It's uh, calcium sulfate. So if, if you're running into this out in your fields, you know, hey, think, you know, you got to think about maybe, you know, can, can we just do something from an amendment perspective, some calcium, some gypsum, you know, something natural, you know? If you see enough of it, does it uh, influence us to change our tillage practices? Maybe reduce it a little bit if you're full tillage right now. Again, lessons in the dirt out here with the shovel. Uh, do some digging out there at Josh Ryan, Banabrio Farms. You have yourself a good day.